So we're going to do the disassembly of the uh, Arms Corps Baby Rock, the Baby Rock 380, one more time for those that uh, need to see it or I goofed up on the video or whatever happened, okay? So basically this is it, this is it okay? I can't do it in reverse, uh, left to right, because I'm right-handed, so it's kind of weird to do it that way. So bear with me. So basically you take the slide, push it back, and you're going to see a little notch. Right there. I think you can see it. Well, the slide stop comes out, not the big notch, the little one in behind it. Okay. Push the slide stop up with your other hand. Pull it up. Okay. Notice I've got my finger stuck down in the chamber. Hold the slide. Pull it forward. You can lay the frame down. Turn it upside down. Let go of the spring. And sometimes the little bushing will come out with it. Take that off, lay that to the side. The barrel bushing, you turn a quarter turn to your left or toward you if you're doing it this way. Pull it out, pull out the barrel. That's it. You can clean this, do whatever you need to do, clean the barrel, clean the spring. Obviously mine needs to be clean, but I'm not there yet. I'm just showing this to you for now. Slide the barrel back in. You can go ahead and put on the barrel bushing, quarter turn to your left and turn it straight up. You can take the spring bushing, put it in from that side if you want. You can do it from the front as well, I'll show you that. But you have to turn that quarter turn, the barrel bushing has to go in, I'll show you that. Right, that's the front without the barrel bushing, the barrel is just sitting inside there, okay? You take the barrel bushing. Quarter turn to your left. Normally you'd flip it up to the right and that would hold this little bushing in place for the spring. So you turn it all the way and now you have room for that bushing. Slide it in. Turn it all the way back straight up and tilt it down and it should seat itself. Okay. Once it seats itself, you can see it there. Okay. Take the spring. Slide it in the back with this notch down. And you're going to seat it right here, right there. Okay, so slide that in. It's going to push that pushing forward, push the spring in, and hold it down. Okay, hold that with your finger. That's all you need to do. Pick up your frame, flip it over, slide it back on. You can let go of that now because the spring's not going to go anywhere. You're going to hold this back. See if I can get a better picture of that. So that little notch, oh, there's a shadow. Hold on. Let's see if I can get out of the shadow. There's a little notch right there, if you can see it. I believe you can, right there. See the little notch? Okay. Take a slide stop. Put it back in. And it should just pop right in. Okay. Popped right in. Let go of the slide. Function test, good to go. Okay, so that's it. That is the disassembly of the baby rock in case you need to do a quick clean. Uh, I will not do a complete teardown today. That would take a much longer video. Uh, we may do one later, but that is all you really need to know for the baby rock. Okay, so have fun. Thanks for watching. Uh, Martin, guys at uh, Arms Corps, Rock Island, thank you for everything always. Um, thanks to the guys at the Rock Island Armory 1911 Facebook page, the original page with uh, Brian Conley as the founder. Thanks to uh, Eric Gale, Marty Genius, Michael Schmidlin, and uh, David Merriman. Thank you guys for all you do every day. I know it's not a fun chore to watch the page 24-7, but that's what we're here for. Uh, I use the standard metal form mag is what comes with these guns now. In the beginning, people complained, saying there were issues with uh, the magazines loading. It was the magazine. It was not the gun. People have said that it was the gun. It was not the gun. It was the magazines. They since went to these metal form mags, and mine's worked flawlessly since I've had it. Uh, if you have any questions, let us know. Thanks for watching. Comments on the bottom. If you have any questions, let us know. Like I said, um, you know, fight for your gun rights. People are being killed every day. If you have any questions, you're welcome to post the comments on below, put them on the YouTube channel, wherever this video winds up being posted. Thanks for all your time. Be safe and watch out for your friends and your family.
Thanks.